Today, we are doing Zelda Breath of the Wild's Priceless Maracas in the Dueling Peaks region. What's up, YouTube? I'm Kat from KK Jinx Gaming, gaming for fun. And today, I'm gonna show you how to complete this side quest. And this quest starts just outside Kakariko Village after you get the quest to seek out Impa. It is on your way if you follow the path. And as you approach, you will see a giant broccoli. It is not actually a broccoli. His name is Hatsu. Let's go ahead and speak with him to get this quest started. Chikala, you, you can see me? No, I can't see you. Chikolo, then how are you talking to me, silly boy? Shalaza, shalaka. It's been a hundred years since anyone's been able to see me. I'm Hatsu and I need your help. Those monsters over there stole my beloved maracas. I think they're still there on the other side of those rocks. Can't use my powers without them, Shoko. So please, please get my maracas back from them. And that activates the priceless maraca side quest. So as he said, the monsters on the other side of this rock have stolen his beloved maracas and we must defeat these monsters and return them to him. And I know at this point in the game, you probably don't have a whole lot of weapons to work with. So I like to climb up here and get myself a vantage point. I like to use ice arrows, makes it a lot easier to kill them, especially when you don't have a lot of weapons because freezing them, when you do hit them from frozen, it deals double damage. So you're able to just go through, hit one each time or twice, a couple times if you need to, but doing the jump attack also deals more damage. And defeating them unlocks this chest. But I like to go around and collect my drops. These are things that you can use to upgrade armor and make elixirs. But let's go ahead and climb up this ladder and open up our chest to reveal the dun 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 Hatsu's Maracas. All right, stuff those in your pockets, backflip off this thing, and let's go back to Hetsu and talk to him to complete this side quest. Kala Kala, those are... Those are my maracas, please give them to me. There you go. Jalaka. But wait, there's something wrong with my maracas. Korok seeds inside are gone. How am I supposed to dance now? So go. If I had just one Korok seed, I could sing, dance, and use my powers to help you. You see, I have the power of inventory expansion. So let me know if you find some Korok seeds and go ahead and talk to him again if you have some Korok seeds. The children of the forest must have taken the Korok seeds from my beloved Maracas. I never thought I'd be the target of one of their pranks, Shoko. But wait, do you have a Korok seed? You do, you got a Korok seed from Moment of the Forest, children. If you'll just give me one Korok seed, I'll make your inventory bigger in return. Yes, please. Shikala, so which stash do you want more slots in? And now at this point, you can choose between weapon stash, bow stash, and shield stash. So just decide which stash that you want to upgrade first. I always like to start with the weapon stash. Okay, yeah, shakaka. And he does this little dance. And it makes you feel all happy inside. And then, dun 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 Your inventory's expanded. Your weapon stash has been expanded. I still smell Korok seeds on you. Want me to expand your inventory again? Yes, and this time I'm choosing bow stash. Oh yeah. And then he's gonna do a dance again. And if you don't want to watch the whole thing, you are able to press X to skip it. And there we go, that's another slot expanded. Dun, 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 dun. More bow space. Your bow stash has been expanded. Oh, look at the time. I need to get back before Grandpa yells at me. Sorry, I have to go, but I still need more Korok seeds. So bring some to the Korok forest if you find any. And that completes the Priceless Maracas side quest. He'll be at the Korok forest after he leaves here, but you can also find him at the Riverside Stable. Once you make your way to the Korok forest to expand your inventory further, make sure that you have plenty of Korok seeds because they are going to increase in price as you go up. For the number of slots that you can have, there are 19 weapon slots plus one for the Master Sword, 13 bow slots plus one for the Bow of Light, and 20 shield slots. The minimum seeds for maximum expansion is 441 seeds. 
Although there are a total of 900 Korok seeds for a complete guide on where to find all the Korok, you can Google interactive Breath of the Wild map and there are a few websites that have really great interactive maps to help you keep track of your side quests, your shrines, shrine quests, and all your Koroks and anything else that you can think of. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to punch that bell square in the face so you don't miss any content released. This is KK Jinx, over and out.